It's time for another edition of Where is the Value? Streets of Capenna. Draft boosters versus set boosters. Which one is going to win? Welcome back to my channel. I am Matt Caster Mage, and I do make Magic the Gathering content every single day here on YouTube. So if you do enjoy my channel, please consider subscribing and joining in on all the fun we have here. Now we have a little video here, three packs of draft boosters and three of set boosters. Now I know it's not a great sample size, but this is just a little bit of fun we have on the channel. So you guys can vote in the comment section before I do this opening. Let me know what do you guys think is going to win, draft boosters or set boosters. Let's go into the draft boosters first, and then we'll take a look at the set boosters. Okay, here it is. I'm gonna vote for set boosters. I just feel like set boosters are just better overall, but you never know. You can get surprised with some draft boosters on occasion. Let's see what we get here. Okay, let's go straight to the uncommons. Maestro's Charm to start things off. Let me get a little closer to the camera for everyone. There we go. Psychic Pickpocket. Riverdeer's Requesters, uh, Requisitor, geez, what? What am I even talking about? Corpse Explosion. There you go. I think we actually have a foil in this pack as well. So that is our rare and it's a foil common Maestro's Initiate. Now we got a beautiful full art swamp there as well. Okay, next draft pack. Here we go. That pack, uh, I'm so used to opening up the collector boosters in this set. These uh, draft packs open up like paper compared to, compared to the other ones. Okay, let's go to the Uncommon again. Oh, that looked like Uncommon for a second. I was like, whoa, that was kind of early in the pack. Obscura Charm. We've got a Scuttling Butler. Or Butler. An offer you can't refuse, and that offer is a rare. It is an Obscura Ascendancy. Can I? Can I refuse that? Yeah, we're hoping for some uh, Tricycle Lands. And we got our land. It's a regular Swamp this time. Okay, I gotta say, Draft Packs... Not very impressive. Not very impressive. Oh, God. You know what isn't impressive? The way these things open. My God. They open like tissue paper compared to the collector packs. Okay. First uncommon in this pack is a stimulus package. Hmm. Stimulus package. What does that remind me of? Huh. Interesting. Yeah. <clears throat> a little bit of checks there. A little bit of stimulus checks. A little chat. Let me get Freelance Muscle, and please be a mythic. Nope, it's a rare getaway car. Oh, <laughs> God. Not very good. Uh, not very good at all, guys. I mean, to be honest, it's going to be pretty easy for the set packs to win this. That was beyond trash. So, no mythics, no trilands. Pretty bad. Okay, let's see what we get. Island. Fire Silence. Let's see where do we get. Oh, there's an uncommon there. Out of the way. Slip out the back. And then we get a public enemy. A lot of blue cards here. And we get an uncommon. Lagrella the Magpie. And another common. Uh, this time, Shattered Seraph. A story spotlight rare. Okay. Yada Font of Hope. Not too bad. Legendary Creature Angel. I think it's actually a decent rare to pull. We get a foil common there. Deal gone bad. Okay, next set pack. Hopefully we get at least one mythic out of these six packs. That'd be nice. Ooh, beautiful island there. Okay. Uh, our first... Ooh, nope, we got a uncommon here. Slip out the back again. Public enemy again. I think we got these. A little chat. And you get a common tramway station. Uncommon here. Mr. Orfeo. I get a rare. It is a boxing ring. Nice artifact there. And another rare. Depopulate. Okay. Nice. We got uh, two rares in this pack. Foil common waterfront district. Ooh. Beautiful foiling on that. Oh! There we go. Abrupt decay. Whoa. That is wicked. The list slot comes out on top. That is amazing. Definitely delivering today. Abrupt decay. Uh, it's, it's one of those cards that's played a lot in Jun and Modern. Um, I think it's actually played in Pioneer as well. So, and Pioneer's been going up. Maybe this card will go up too. Used to be a very expensive card, and then, uh, I think 
it was Assassin's Trophy when it came out in a Guild of Ravnica. It kind of pushed the price of this down because some people say that that card is better than this one. So I don't know. Let me know in the comment section if you guys like that card. Abrupt Decay. I think it's a sweet pull. That was wicked. All right. Oh, no. I don't think we got anything on the list this time. But we got a beautiful island there again. Disdainful Stroke and Obscura Charm is our first uncommon. Riverdeer's Charm. Crew Captain. And then we get it, Mr. Orfeo the Boulder. And we've got another uncommon here, Crew Captain. Oh, we got a Mythic. Finally, we got a Mythic. Oh, nice! It is Falco Spara, Pact Weaver, Bird, Demon, Legendary Creature. That is absolutely wicked. Thank God we got something nice here. Uh, that last pack was pretty good, mostly saved because of the Abrupt Decay. And then we get a Foil Common here. Big score. That was our big score right there. You guys saw it. Okay. Um, I don't even have to... Yeah, I don't even have to edit the video to know which set packs won, which were the set packs. Uh, that was pretty insane. Falco. And we got Abrupt Decay. This is all... These two are from... Where's... Uh, and Giada. There you go. These three right here came out of the set packs. Pretty, pretty nice. Let me know what you think of these videos down in the comment section. I'll keep making them. And with that being said, I'll see you in the next video.